Hello and welcome to my shop. Today we're going to do a quick one. We're going to do something for the shop. And yeah, you guessed it. It's going to be this. A paper roll holder. And this is uh, on the French clip right here. I can take it anywhere. So you can see French clip. So let's work on that together. Put it back. If you need paper on the shop, here you go. Quick one, very easy build. So the paper I have is 28 inches wide and it's uh, 140 feet. So that's about four inches in diameter. So what we're gonna use is we're, we're gonna use um, 30 inch by five inch backboard and the sides we're gonna use, in this case, piece of scrap, but it's nine inches by four and a half or something. So I'm gonna split that in half and then find the center and drill a hole. Um, it will not be a through hole, uh, so there's gonna be a three quarter hole done with a portion a bit on one side and then another one on the other side, but then we're gonna clear a path for the rod to go through. We can put new rolls of paper whenever this one's out. So here it is, I'm gonna drill the holes first and then cut everything at the bend so it will be easier. I'm going to also add chamfers so I don't have any sharp corners and make it a bit prettier. So let's get to everything now. Send a little bit of everything too. Let's clear the path of the rod. And it's done. The rod goes in there like a glove. And here it is. And boom, on the floor. Here, go pick it up, dude. Now I'm using the pieces to mark the thickness so I can build the holes at the right location. And for this bill we're going to use glue and deck screws, 2 inches deck screws, number 8.
I'm gonna try to find out what the length of the rod needs to be first and measure the depth of the hole I made on the one side. And then I put the rod in place and mark it on the other side to find the length. I'll mark it. And then I add a little bit more. So the depth of the hole minus a smidge, and that's it. And now we just cut it with a handsaw. Nothing fancy. Here it is. And then the little sanding to make it easier to go in. And it's almost done. Let's see if it fits. Put one side in the hole, the other side in the groove. And here we are. This is finished. Almost. And you put the finished bits in the back. Let's see what it is with a piece of foam. Let's see what it is with the paper in there. Let's see if it fits. Do it again. First side in the hole. And the other side in the groove. And it's working. Oh, good. Let's now work on the French clip. I have two pieces of scrap. I'm gonna cut a 45 degree angle. That's pretty much it. Now I'm adjusting the fence to make sure it's in the right place. And we'll go ahead and cut both pieces. One will go in the wall and one will go, will go on the fixture. Well, I hope you enjoyed this one. It's a very quick one. Uh, it's always good to have uh, things for your shop, especially I uh, didn't know what to do with this uh, roll of paper here, which was always in my way. So now it's out of my way and it's here when I need it. So thanks for tuning in and we'll catch you later.